So what are you looking on to improve on, on last week's performance? Um, I think the key this week, going into this weekend, is hitting 24 for 24. I think we feel like we haven't done that yet. So I think that that would be a huge step for us is to put 24 out of 24 routines on the on the floor. This is the last SEC meet. Um, you had two SEC teams at St. Louis last week. Are you looking for a high road score for RQS that comes out next week? Definitely. Um, you know, we have the opportunity where we can replace all three of our RQS scores still. I mean, we still have three road, road meets left. So um, I think the biggest thing for us is that, like I said before, if we hit 24 for 24, we're going to put out the score that we want. So it's more focusing on the gymnastics rather than the score. Hey, Haley Gardner competed in an all-around first time last week. She had yeah. two good scores and two okay scores. What do you think of her performance? Oh, Hagar. Um uh, proud of her for stepping up. She's done a phenomenal job stepping up to get into the all-around. Um, I think the biggest thing for her is just going to be getting more numbers, getting more experience in that role. I think she's growing into that all-around role very well, um, but I just think that she needs she needs more experience to get there. Um, she did a phenomenal job on beam and floor. Vault and bars were a little bit off, some uncharacteristic things for her there, but I think she's going to grow into that. Coach last week talked about how the gym quarters was kind of a test, a pretest for SC tournament and nationals. Mm -hmm. How do you guys feel that you did in terms of that? Man, it was a tough environment. Um, anytime, you know, you go on podium, you go on the road, I think that's a tough environment, but it's a great precursor to what we're going to do in the postseason. I think um, it's definitely giving us opportunities to prepare for that postseason. I mean, this team is, you know, faced the best teams in the nation week in and week out, and I think they're going to be battle-tested once postseason gets there. Um, I think they're going to be ready to go. Bouncing back from last week's meet, how, do you, how have the girls responded this week? Phenomenal. Uh, Monday was a really good day for training. Um, looking to put that together today. Wednesday, we've got one more day of training before we leave, but, you know, they've done a phenomenal job responding. You know, our biggest thing was just looking at the positives of what we did well, um, you know, moving past the negatives, not dwelling on it, um, and just preparing well for Florida. Amanda's really seemingly caught fire. 11 of the past 12 scores have been over 9.8. Do you expect that to continue and for her to lead the team? Absolutely. Well, he's a rock for sure. Um, she's done a phenomenal job for us, but, you know, she's she's also working to get back on floor. Uh, so I think you'll see her in the all around here in the next few weeks. But she's done a she's done a phenomenal job just being a senior and just leading this team by example.